Hello, this is Scott Bogren, Editor-in-Chief of Digital CT Magazine, and I'm here to welcome you to our third edition, a, a edition of our publication focusing on new policy directions. And uh, we've broken up this edition into uh, several key components, and I want to go through those with you real quickly, steer you to some of the uh, content and articles that I think you, you'll really find some benefit from, and in the end, ask something of you, which is to join in a, a broader dialogue on policy issues that we think is just so important. The first section of this publication focuses on rural, rural mobility. And what we try to talk about there is, one, give you some ideas about the current state of rural America, the state of rural transportation, and then discuss some key issues and what we view as solutions. We do the same thing for urban transportation where we cover again the state of urban America, the state of urban transit, key issues, key solutions. Uh, we think there's some excellent policy points that will come forward in those two discussions that can frame up some of the discussion that we hope to have with you directly both via a uh, campaign we're going to launch which I'll talk about in a second and also at our community transportation expo this June in Indianapolis. The next section is, a, is an important section. It focuses on connectivity, and that's really how do we bring America together again when it comes to a national transportation policy and national surface transportation network. We've spent the last 30 years uh, really investing in urban systems and rural systems, but how do we connect those together, and why is that important? That's kind of the focus of that discussion. Our fourth section focuses on financing and this is a this is a, a key part of this magazine because there is lots of good discussion here in Washington right now about policy ideas but there's a lack of discussion about how do we pay for that and we take that challenge and give you some ideas about how to focus on not just spending and investing in the trust fund which is important but some of the other ways we think we can diversify national surface transportation investments so that we have a, a, a structure to finance the system that is equivalent to the service which is diversified that is the output of the system. We have an article that we, we're really fond of which, which really consists of excerpts from the U.S. Chamber of Commerce's testimony in front of a Senate committee here and that talks from a very specific agenda about the economic impacts of investing in the surface transportation network and in the work that all of you do. Uh, the chamber is speaks from that business perspective and, and is not necessarily uh, invested in the transit network to talk about transit but is invested in the outcomes from that network. The last section of the publication is what we like to call Join Our Dialogue. And that is where we first begin to talk about a campaign, an educational campaign, that the magazine will be launching this spring, which will be brought to you and, and you'll hear about in the future with some web uh, content. And really what we're trying to do there is make sure that you, our readers, our members, our advocates, our friends, that you are doing the work at the local level to have the important discussions with elected officials about why transportation is so important at the local level. And you'll see there's a great outline of kind of how those discussions have gone thus far with some of our members who have already done it and some ideas that lead into what will be, as I said, our broader campaign. We've had such great response to the digital publications. We're very excited about them and uh, we continue to kind of hone the process, provide content in new ways, and uh, as always, please feel free to contact me directly at cteditor at ctaa.org or you can even pick up the phone and give me a call at 202-247-1921. We want to make sure that Digital CT continues to meet your needs and is the best publication it can be and I would as always 
like to thank you for taking the time to watch this video and to take a run through the articles and, and ideas and concepts that really are our new policy direction edition of Digital CT. Thank you.